And a Department of Economic Development continues water and aquifer testing in Tippecanoe County. News 18's Vinnie Martirano is live near the Wabash River with their thoughts on the progress. Vinnie. Yeah, Jeff Marley, the IEDC has started testing on the aquifer right here on the Wabash River. They say things are going really well and according to plan. News 18 previously reported the IEDC has acquired 9,000 acres of land to build an industrial park in Lebanon. The area around the park does not have the water resources to support it. They want to pump water from Tippecanoe County to Lebanon. We are hearing anywhere from around 15 million gallons a day to 100 million gallons a day. The Tippecanoe County Commissioners and Lafayette Mayor Tony Rosworski attended the annual water summit in Indianapolis. It's too early to share the exact numbers of their tests, but the IEDC told local officials the testing is going really well. Again, they haven't shared any specifics, but they, they called the test results textbook. I believe Mr. Whitman used the term appeared promising. The commissioners meet with IEDC and other local elected officials, legislators, and Purdue experts every other month to discuss where they're at with the project. The IEDC told them they will have exact results later this year. When the data is available, we will be have access to that data so we can have a third party review it to make sure that there is no long-term implications for this community. Although they don't have the results, IEDC has started moving forward with the project. IEDC has already signed a contract for the preliminary engineering for this pipeline. They've already um, signed a contract to do utility locates for a potential uh, uh, pipeline is on moving forward with the project. You know, we wish that they would perhaps slow down and wait till we actually have results. Vice President of Strategic External Communications with IEDC, Aaron Switzer, said in a statement to News 18, Part of the IEDC's process for development of LEAP is to assist the development of short and long-term strategies for water distribution in central Indiana. This effort will not Their only assist communities through the area, but will also set up Indiana for greater economic development opportunities in the coming decades. Rosworski says they aren't just sitting around waiting for the results to come in. We are moving forward with some of our own additional plans to ensure our sustainability into the, the future. And Commissioner Murtaugh says he has a growing concern that Tippecanoe County may run out of water. Reporting live near the Wabash River, Vinnie Motorano, News 18.